Okay, my friends, in this video, I'm going to explain to you basically everything you need to know to begin growing your own potatoes. Now, in this video, we're going to discuss chitting. What is chitting? Uh, we're going to discuss when to plant the potatoes and the difference between the early, mid, and late season potatoes, and plus some other tips, I'm sure. So we'll see where it goes. First thing, chitting. You hear a lot about you have to chit the potatoes first. Now, that's kind of an exotic word for a rather simple process. Chitting essentially is just taking the potato from its smooth, round state that you would get in the store and setting it in an open container like this and putting it in a sunny, warm spot for about two weeks. And that will induce the potato to begin sprouting. And you will see these are eyes. Each one of those sprouts we call eyes. Now, that is chitted enough. Uh, but then they will advance a little bit more and grow like this. They can advance more and grow like this. At any stage along the way, they can be planted. So it doesn't matter if they're this long. It doesn't matter if they're that long, really. That I mean, that's pushing it. But it's all good. You can plant them at any stage along the way. But I do recommend chitting just to know you didn't get some whack potatoes that aren't going to sprout. All right. That's all it is. Uh, then people are asking me, is it too late to plant potatoes? absolutely not my friends okay so we're gonna keep it I'll simplify it there's early mid and late season potatoes tons of different varieties of all that so we're just gonna keep it simple the early potatoes from the time you first see the sprout above ground the green part until the plant dies and is ready for harvest early potatoes it's about 80 days mid potatoes it's about a hundred days late potatoes it's about 120 days okay so plan accordingly if you have a nice long growing season i would recommend growing late potatoes also early potatoes so that you get some that finish middle of summer so that you can be eating potatoes but the the late season potatoes like the burbank or the the uh, gold rush russets or the german butterballs or even the kennebec is like a mid to late those are going to store the best now here's the tip okay here's a big secret the faster that the, the potato uh, matures and harvests, the less amount of time it generally stores. So the red ones, even though they finish in 75 days, like a red New Orleans, they don't store nearly as long as the Kennebex or the German Butterball. And the Yukon Gold is about in the middle of all those. It's a mid-season and a middle-length storage, but good, versatile uh, potato. So um, when to plant? two weeks before your last frost date and all the way up until three months before your first frost date you understand so i would not push it any further there's no need to because potatoes can take a light frost but once they go above the ground and you start seeing the the uh green part they don't like frost it's going to kill back the parts of the plant so just two weeks and that'll give them time to push up through the soil during those two weeks and by the time they're above soil no more frost okay all the way up until about three months before the first frost because that will kill them off okay so how to plant now there's tons of different ways to plant and you i've made videos about a couple of different ways and i'll make more videos on how to plant potatoes but the essential elements are all the same the potatoes like to uh, they like a fluffy light soil so the potato is essentially stored energy from the Sun so you plant the potato and you cover it no matter what method you're using I recommend you cover it 6 to 12 inches of loose fluffy soil or leaf mold or straw or whatever it may be horse manure uh, whatever it may be and the potato will use the stored energy that is in the tuber to produce these uh, that will power up it will work its way through a foot of soil no problem so long as it's light and fluffy and then once it reaches above the soil it's going to turn green and it will begin making the plant and contrary to popular belief potatoes uh, all but just a couple varieties potatoes only set tubers these are tubers at the same level of the original potato they will not set tubers below or much above maybe an inch or two above but not the reason that people mound the potatoes is not to get more potatoes it is to block out light from reaching the tuber because if you plant it in just this much soil 
the tubers will bulge out and they will get sunlight. And once the tuber gets sunlight, it will turn green and it's inedible. Okay, so you don't want the tuber to ever reach uh, direct sunlight at all. And that's why we mound them. That's why we bury them in a lot of uh, leaf mold or straw or whatever it is. So keep it super simple. Just get you some potatoes. It, it doesn't really matter uh, if this is your first time growing potatoes just I recommend the grow bag method it's so easy so effective and just get some potatoes don't worry about the mid uh, early mid late season put them in the ground or put them in the bag and cover them uh, with the soil watch the the potato bag videos okay and uh, then when the plants they will grow for whatever their allotted time is and they will start to die back once they die back wait another week or two and dig into your potatoes Okay, another thing people often ask is, do I cut the potatoes before planting? You see commercial growers do that a lot. Personally, I've done it both ways and I've not found that much of a difference in yield. Uh, in fact, I feel that the whole potato produces a bigger, stronger, healthier plant and therefore a better harvest. So personally, I never cut the potatoes. I plant whole potatoes. It's super simple. So let me know if you have any questions. I'm sure I missed all kinds of stuff, but this should give you a, a general idea because there's so many different varieties and so many different techniques, but they all operate along the same principles. Okay? So get planting the potatoes, my friends. Now's the time.